We're back for another Star Citizen video, and today I'm showing. Can, can I, if I can get out of here, I'm gonna show. Anyways, I'm gonna show off my caterpillar, my Drake caterpillar. It's an epic, epic cargo ship. I have an addiction. It's fine. If I can get out of. Okay, that's fine. I'm pretty excited to show you guys. I haven't even seen it myself yet. I got it a while back during the the uh, uh, Evictus event, and I haven't gotten into it yet because I want to make a video on it. But I've you know been a little busy, so you know here we are. Can I make a video on it? If you do enjoy, make sure you subscribe. I'm almost I'm literally I'm literally one away from 150. Please, I'm begging you. I'm begging. Actually, I'm not begging. I'm not that low, but I would appreciate if you did subscribe. Yeah, it'd be really awesome of you. Anyways, uh, I'll be back when the delivery is here. Let's go. We got it. I have to say, before we even do this, I just love the cycling thing. It's like I like how the just sound disappears. You walk out and it's just quiet, you know? It's just so cool. How big is this MF right here? I want to see. I am really curious. Oh my. That's definitely bigger than I thought. Oh, and look at that. Definitely bigger than I thought it would be. Holy crap. Look at these engines, dude. I think, I think these engines are bigger than the, the hammerheads. Just massive. Holy crap. Look at that gun, though. Yeah, that's not bad, you know? Nice little defense. Nice little elevator. Let's go up. Let's see. Oh my gosh, this game is just so cool. I wish there was more. Okay. So habituation, habituation, habitation, right? I'm I'm an idiot. Anyways, living quarters. Got. I think these are just areas of sleep. Yeah. I think this is a two-person ship. Maybe. I don't know. Got a nice little eating area. Some screens. Ooh, we got our first cargo hanger, or module, I mean, module one. This will be module two. That's so cool. It's just like repeats. You know what been even more cool? Even though I bet it'd be super hard for them to add this, is that if they made it like detachable, you know, and like magnetized, so you can like deploy them, that'd be epic. And like you can buy more if you want to add on to your ship you know like like a really really beneficial upgrade and the last module oh we have a visitor dang Never seen it up. Never, never. I've never seen the A90 jump this close before. I think it's just vibing though. You know, this is the front of the ship, nice and open. Ah, oh, this game. That that's such a cool, so cool. Okay, so we gotta try to get the second floor, because there is some stuff up here. So I guess this is like rem remote access. I think this, there's a glass right here, so if the thing opens up, you're not going to be dying. Oh, is this turret? Yes, it is. Let's see this turret. Oh, wow. That is a decent... I have no idea what size guns this, these are. Maybe five? I doubt there's six, but there might be six. That's so cool. Oh, 
fire on an 890 jump. I'm tempted. You have no idea. Okay, let's get out of this. So yeah, it looks like we can just open up from right here. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Gosh, so cool. I wish um, uh, Starfield is gonna be as good as like as cool as this game with the ships and how they function. Cause dang, are, is this game just so advanced? So I don't know what the point of it being being up here and attracting it. Maybe if you can't walk around down there. And then you can just go right here, but why is there... Oh, wait, what? Okay, wait, wait, open. Okay, that's starboard. Starboard. I don't know what the difference is between starboard and port. We'll close that. And then if I open port, what opens? Oh, I'm brain dead. Okay, I didn't know it opened this way too. That is so cool. Holy crap. That is blinding too. You know what would be so cool? If you can set up like a mini gun right here. Like you just have like a large weapon. And oh, that ship has definitely gotten closer. And uh, you just like, you know, you do a drive by with uh, another ship as you just shoot a, a mini gun at them. That'd be so cool. Uh, is it gonna take its time yeah oh I just open I'm you know this is just proving how branded I actually am anyways and all sealed again that's so cool obviously this is the exact same so we're gonna keep going and again the same again let's go So, if I remember correctly, there's a computer area where you can, uh, not only can you cargo, um, like, phys physicalized items, you can use the, the servers to cargo, I don't know, maybe information, data, uh, that's probably what it is. Yeah, right here, here it is. So, we got the servers, you can, uh, these seem pretty unadvanced for the time. Considering this is hundreds of years, five, I mean, actually, it's probably like 500 years in the future, yeah, so it's like, seems less advanced than I thought it'd be. A, it's fine. Oh, we got the power. Let's go. The jump drive. We'll go down here. Okay, here's the jump drive. There's a turret in here that we can get into. I'm guessing it's another one. So maybe, I think this house this can use four people, I'm guessing. Stairway. The nice. It's kinda weird to have a stairway though, considering I thought every other place was using the flatters. Yeah, I guess maybe it helps out people. Oh whoa! A tractor beam, okay. That's cool. There's that. Uh, wait, what? Let me just pack up the, the, the words. That is not, that is not put correctly, as you can tell. Wait, what the heck does that say? Okay, whatever. Command access. Oh, and here's the flying. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four. Yeah, so four people plus the turreters. So maybe like six people at most. So we get that turret. And I'm guessing a turret below or a, yeah, probably below. I think we've pretty much explored the entire ship. We're going to take a little fly. I want to go buy that, um, that, uh, that cool ship. There's flight ready. Comms. Yeah, okay. Let's do this. 
Uh, okay. Well, it just disappeared. Oh, okay. That is... Okay, this might be one of the easiest ships to fly, though. If you realistically think about it. Oh, I... Shot in an armistice zone. That was stupid of me. I... Don't know why I wasn't, uh, being stopped. Look at that ship go. Okay, well, I'm gonna land again. I'm probably gonna do my first ever cargo run with this bad boy in a little, um, in the future. I hope you guys enjoyed this, by the way. I did. I love this ship. It's so cool. Oh, my gosh. So, this game has so much potential. That's... Actually, one of the reasons I love it so much, it's not because of what it is right now, it's what it can become. Okay, well, I'm going a little too slow. Maybe a little faster. Maybe subscribe, guys. Give me that 150. Oh my gosh, I am so, I am so close. I am so close. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Let, let's look at the, the legs uh, come down. And you can just see it perfectly, too. Look at that. Oh my. You don't have to ever like look to see if your landing gear is going down. Obviously it can tell you, but you know, I like looking just in case. And landing this, it seems like it'd be so convenient. <laughs> I love this game so much. Oh my gosh. Even when I, when I you know, I haven't even played it. Uh, I should just stop talking. Okay. Well, I'll see you guys in the next one. This was kind of a a weird video definitely a weird video 100% a weird video but I enjoyed it